What's going on YouTube? Kyle can come at you with another episode of Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. So if you are enjoying the series, please be sure to hunt down and carve out that like button to show your support for the series. Anyway, in this episode, uh, one more episode to go before we actually go and end up saving Kyle Cat. <laughs> I know I've been putting it off for a while, but um, I just want to get these monsters done. I should have done this before Kyle Cat left, but um, see, thing is, I forgot that as soon as I talked to um, I definitely need icebreaker for this. That as soon as I talked to the cavernier, a uh, caravanier, that Kyle Cat was just going to disappear. Uh, kind of as you saw in that episode, because I, I thought I was getting thrusted into the uh, Gormagala fight. But, okay, gonna do that. And as you can see, I'm, I'm wearing my uh, my Queen's Rapier now. Or my Prince's Rapier. I love this weapon. I don't know why. Uh, equipment. There we go. Prince's Rapier. Got a decent amount of green sharpness. I don't know why I like this weapon. I, I guess it's like the, the appearance of it. I don't know. But, uh, anyway... Uh, let's go take on the Lagombi. Uh, this one. Shouldn't be too hard. It's not that hard, actually. Um, I don't have the appropriate element weapon, though, so... It might take me a little bit longer than it should. A smidgen longer. But I still can't have a fire weapon, because, you know, I can't. I'm not allowed. It's actually not allowed for me to have a fire weapon at this point. Okay. Um... Oh, they give you these. Okay. Uh, snatch those up. I believe he starts in area three. I'm fairly certain that he starts in area three. I kind of like this monster. Um, with this, I don't think there's a reason why I would dislike this monster. He's not hard to fight at all. He's actually like baby food. I mean, he's a he's just a rabid bunny. <laughs> Wait, why are these guys running? Hello, is there something else here that I should know about? Uh, guys, can I be informed? Hello, are you dummy? Anyone? Is this a game? I think that's what they're thinking right now. They're thinking, this is definitely a game. We better run. Uh, so, he should be appearing right now. And, like, I think this area is just perfect for him to just start in. Just look at this. Look at my weapon, though. Oh, look, look, a little snowball. And it's like, oh, look, a snowball. It seems like the snowball is getting smaller as it rolls down the hill, which doesn't make too much sense to me because you should be picking up snow as you're rolling down the hill because you know there's more snow going down the hill and then like this little gomi just <laughs> just looks so badass by smashing through the snowball that he threw but uh yeah he's like a big hamster bunny thingy mabobber which is pretty cool i mean it looks kind of adorable in a creepy kind of way anyway this is the Lagombi. his uh element is ice his uh ailments is ice bite and his weakest to fire and then thunder um i don't still don't have a fire weapon like i said i do have a thunder weapon but that's because um i am i have the kazoo shock hammer no not kazoo shock hammer no what the stop i have the kazoo hammer i don't know what it's called like purse something purse bop bop purse i don't know um, but yeah, this guy slides around. Um, his breakable parts include his ears. Actually, speaking of ears, you should be able to sonic bomb this man. I just don't know when. Oh, well, I guess like right now. I guess like the cut coup, but if you... What the fuck? Why does it look so ominous over there? Wait, does anyone else see that? Holy crap. Has it always looked like that? Have I just never noticed? I think I just never noticed. Come over here, please. Damn, I tried to roll. Wait, that wasn't right. Now let's ride this guy. Yay, bunny! Hey, bunny! Hey, bunny! Bunny! So, you don't actually have to fight the Lagombi at all in this game. So, I don't know if anything's changed about him between this game and the last game. Like, from the ride mechanic. I broke his ears by riding his back. Okay. I just love... Look at this weapon go. Like, it's an actual rapier. It just has, uh... It should be just about dead now. An interesting... I guess kind of interesting. Wait, where's the shiny? 
The Cree! Oh, damn it. The Cree! Oh, a plaster rune. I think I need that. I don't know if I might. You can actually get the Lagomi dual blades if you're running dual blades. Uh, they're not bad. And I'm getting careless right now because I'm like, this is Lagomi. I don't need to worry about anything. As you get, like, I'm not even sharpening my weapon right now. Alright. I'm going to start evading now. I also kind of don't really want to um, sharpen. I, don't want, I forgot to jump quick sharpener back in, but I'm going to do it anyway. Because I need to sharpen. Oh, look at that. An interesting thing about this guy is that when he... Um, when he's weak, instead of sliding away, he'll actually limp. Oh, that was that another ride? Oh, pff, I guess so. <laughs> this is pretty fun. I like Lagombi. I don't really like fighting him, because I usually have no reason to. I'm just going to spam through it. I probably shouldn't even be using this weapon against him right now. This weapon is definitely not. I definitely have a stronger weapon than this, I think. Wait, does this have 168 power? I think it does. Alright, limp away now. It's time. Why haven't you fallen over yet? Have not attacked your legs enough? I guess I haven't attacked his legs enough from the trip. Damn it! I haven't, haven't I been, like, attacking his legs the entire time? Isn't that what I've been attacking? Come on! Thought I've been attacking his legs the entire time. Maybe I, in reality, I just haven't. Oh, I guess he falls over now. I don't think I need like any plastic runes. Oh, never mind, he's dead now. <laughs> so this was a lot shorter than I thought it would be. Um, I don't. Let's see how long. Oh my god, this video has been seven minutes long so far. Um, okay. Uh, I didn't think I would kill it that fast. I, that wasn't even that. Definitely, that definitely wasn't even that fast. That was a rather slow hunt on my part. Yeah, six minutes for Lagombi. Probably able if I had a fire weapon or just using nice and poison. Because I love this weapon. I don't know. I guess it's just the aesthetics of it that I just like. But, yeah. That quest was a lot... Shorter than I thought it would be. It's not even that. Like, I don't know. I I just wasn't expecting to be done with this done with the quest I was supposed to be doing eight minutes into the video. That was really um yeah I have nothing else planned. Uh, maybe you know what? I think it's time. I think I'm gonna have to go after Gore. I think it is about that time. It's gonna happen. It's time. Okay, we're gonna be here. Macalite. Group bone, we're gonna be faster rune. Okay, well. Fatal Flurry. Okay. I'll save. Um. I guess I'll go rescue Kyle Cat and the Ace Hunters now. Nice work, Doodle. Can I um, keep some of your materials? No? Okay. Why would you need my material? Never mind. Alright, so since our quest was so short, um. The box. Are my mushrooms done yet? No, okay. Um, alright, so I guess I'll go change my weapon real quick and go fight out this Gormakawa. No, I, I was just in there. Manage. Okay, level appropriate. Um, I'm gonna use this. I don't know if this will actually work on him right now. Um, but I'm gonna try it anyway. 
I was thinking about cheese killing Gore Magala in the fight that he's in, just because I really want to get past him, and um, and you know get better weapons, because I <laughs> uh, I can't get a fire weapon until after I beat Gore Magala, and lo and behold, Gore Magala is weak to fire. That's one of the things he's weak to. Um, I don't think I still don't think I'll have his bio up in this uh, in this episode though, be simply because. Uh, we have to rescue the Ace Hunter, so that's going to be a primary focus, not fighting the Gormagala. I don't need these. Um, actually, hold on. Let me see. Since I don't know if it's possible to put him to sleep this time around, maybe I'll just end up making the this. Or actually, I couldn't make this. Did I have no sharpness, though? Yeah, the same amount of sharpness, but this has sleep. 5% affinity. Um, that's 140. What's the attack on 140, 150? Alright, you know what? Yeah. Oh, Alright, I have to go into the Everwood by myself. Okay. So, what you're going to do here is uh, you're going to hit the globe at the bottom. Uh, click the expedition, the, the blue stamp. It's going to say Gormagala. You might be able to see part of it right now. Um, I'm just going to depart. And actually, no, 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 no. I need null berries. Let me get some null berries before I go. Um, now I'll go. I feel like I'm just going to do terrible on this because I'm kind of hungry. Slightly tired. I mean, I got to sleep last night. I don't know why I'm tired right now. I, don't know, I kept waking up during the night. Throwing through the night. I forgot to eat. You gotta go find your main palico on those ace hunters and fast. Be advised. It sounds like you got a Gormagala in the area too. So watch your back out there. Uh Rue returning to town. Uh, <laughs> I gotta eat. I'm not doing this again. You saw what happened last time I forgot to eat. Why do I keep I always forget to eat on these silly quests like this. Not even like on a real quest. <laughs> Well, I mean, there was that one time I forgot to eat on Tetsu Kaiba Quest like three times, but let's not talk about that. Imagine they just gave me a game over because I was like, nope, you can't play anymore. Like, you fucked up, Kenny. I'm like, wait, what? What do you mean? It's like, yeah, it, it's over. Wow, you know what I just realized? This, uh. Feeling right, sir. This. <laughs> the little table and chairs are, are set up like a cat's paw, and I just realized that now. Like the little Poligo paws? Ha <laughs> Okay. I hope the Gormagala is still there. Why am I sitting now? You're still there, Gormagala? Okay. Mm, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine. Gormagala is not that much of a threat anyway. I say not that much because, like... I think Gormagala is much harder than the Shigara Magala. That's just me personally, though. I just have less problem with the Shigara. It's usually because, well, Shigaru is in one area, so I have to go chasing him down. I mean, I can't try, you can't trap Shigaru, but, like, you get plenty of rides off in that one area because there's plenty of ledges. And, like, his moves are very predictable. Whereas I feel like Gormagala is just more unpredictable. But that's probably just me. It's probably, I'm probably the only one in thinking that. What? Oh well. We see the lance user and the sword and shield user. And the Kyle Cat's there backing him up. Like, how are you so. How are you getting so fucked up? You're letting, you're letting my cat just, just come out of nowhere and try to run this man's pockets. Wait, he's not using sword and shield right now. He's using insect glaive. To try to distract him. It's fine though, because I'm about to mob in. <laughs> and I'm just on the Gormagala's back. So I wonder, like, wait, I don't remember if I start off in a ride. I don't think I do. I'm holding R in case I do. No, I don't. Okay. Oh my gosh! Wait, why are you trying to catch me? You'll get crushed! That was actually one of the silliest things you could do. 
Like, my body could have crushed your entire being. Are they both alright? And your furry pal too? Phew, I was worried there for a minute. Alright, Kindred Hunter, the rest is up to you and your feline friend. My apologies and thanks. I hate to miss a fight, but I think I'll let you take this one. I'll help get, get him back to safety. You keep, you're trying to keep the Gormagala busy too. Thank a bunch of watch. I hate this guy. I don't think it's possible for them to... Uh, for you to fail this aside from dying. Because I know, like... Like, I don't think he can actually attack them. I mean, like, if he can, then I'm just, What? Well, I didn't think that would hit me. Okay. I know, I'm just getting fucked up. Okay, have that up there. Have one of these. Get fucked up again. Get fucked up again. Alright, thanks, Kyro Cat. Let me heal again, because I keep getting fucked up. Like, immediately after I do something. I hope he's not hitting the hunters back there. Wow, that, that kind of curves! Damn it, hit one little step he took. Now, you can cut his tail during this. It's kind of hard to. Oh, he, what? You can actually put him to sleep? Wait. I actually wasn't expecting this. I don't like the way he sleeps. Like, which is, I think, I, I, don't, I don't think I'm able to do this without evade plus two, but. Yeah, no, I can't do that without evade. Um, because I don't know the invincibility frames. Now, once you do enough damage to this guy, you can actually, um... You can actually leave this area. But until then... It's good to know you can actually put him to sleep during this, though. Can infect me, please, so I can fight off the infection. Oh! I forgot about that! Oh, that broke his face. I mean, yeah, bombs to the face usually will break someone's face. And this is low rank, so... Those weren't even... Well, come on, son! Alright, he's leaving the area now. Whoa, you you did it! You drove away the Gormagala! Well, we're gonna go home on the go and still good. See you later, Rose! Later? What, the, what does that even mean? Okay, so now what we have to do is... I'm gonna use a potion, too. Oh, wait, do I, did I get a... Uh, and then a null berry? I don't really need to use a null berry. Um, gotta gotta walk up to this part. Gotta wait for them. I'm using the berry because they're taking too long. Because they have to blow this up. Because I can't do it. Oh man, this boulder's totally blocking the way. Wait over there. Damn, our luck, Velocipray. We gotta hurry. Okay, I have a plan. I'll whoop up some explosive and get this boulder blown a bit. Boy, did I say Kelby bits? Hunter, you have about dealing with those Velociprey. Don't worry about this guy. I'll keep him safe. All right. Holy shit! Why is this just like a big ass pack of Velociprey? One, two, three, four. How many? Oh, let me stop. Okay, it's four. All right, the explosives are set. Now for the fun part. Cover your ears. Oh, you can fight off the wiper virus without hitting the monster that infected you. All right, continue on. Um, obviously, since didn't say push complete yet, we haven't completed the quest, so. What now, Ben of Congas? Okay, I have another play. You take care of the Congas. Hey, it worked out pretty good last time. Okay. On the bright side, at least we're getting... Um, points. Oh, you ain't getting me with that. I ain't getting pooped on. That's not my, that's not my, uh, the thing I'm into. Let 
Okay, take out this Kong, and then I gotta... Sh I forgot to put speed sharpening back in once again! Oh, that was amazing. You tore those... Tore right through those guys. Again, you have my things. And my apologies, I could not help. You better keep moving. Hold it together, old timer. I'll have you back soon. I... I'm fine. Onward, quickly. Okay... I think it's in the next area we have to fight off the Gormagala once again. Or it might be this area. This might be the last area uh, that we have to get through. So I'm going to be this area. So once I get to about the middle, I think, because there's another rock block in the way. These rocks aren't even usually here. Okay. Wait, is, isn't it usually this way too? Pretty sure it usually is. I don't know. Yeah, no, it's usually not all the way on this side of the map. Then again, the Everwood is pretty random. So, there is that. Yo, hurry up! Jeez! Alright, I think about it right now. What the? Do you see that shadow? Damn, the Gormagala, it's back! We're almost there, but if we don't get you back soon, Hunter, we'll push on ahead. Please try to keep the Gormagala busy for us. All right, where are you at? Oh, I ain't trying to get fucked up. This Kanga is though. Why are these Kongas back? They actually can't do anything. I'm not going to be able to cut this guy's tail off, by the way. In case you were wondering. Oh, dear. Whoop. I thought he was going to go in rage mode. Can you get out of that? Can you get out of the sky, please? I can't flash bomb you. Actually, I think I can. I don't know how much effect it would actually have, but I think I can. Don't ask what that sound was, please, because I don't know myself. Alright, are you guys done yet? Because I have to heal. I really don't want to. Keep my items on deck, though. Yeah, because we actually have to... Alright, I have to heal, because I, I keep fucking up. Actually, now watch me not get hit anymore, now that I've healed... Oh, wait, I, I evaded through that? Or did I get hit? I That tail always gets me! Every time! Every time he does that attack, the tail always hits me. Okay, come on. Are they there yet? All right, come on, come on. Oh. No. Oh, nope, that got me. That definitely got me. I forgot. <laughs> I thought he was doing that attack, not the uh, aerial explosion. You've got to be kidding me. Another boulder? Okay, same plan as before. I'll make some explosive and boulder boulder down. You stay on top of that Gormagala situation. Got it? Well, all right. Get out of the air. There we go. And that's, and that's it. I can actually skip this. So I think that's it. That's not even a large barrel bomb. That was like, he put down a tiny one. Unless they just didn't show the animation now for him to put down a large one. So I think that's the Gormagala. The re repelling the Gormagala at least. There we go. See, it's pretty easy. It just gets kind of drawn out because you have to kill the Velociprey and the Kongas and stuff like that. You can then cut the tail. Uh, I wasn't able to do it. Um... I get a defiled scale though. That's pretty cool. 
Oh, I know that goes up as well. Okay, that's cool to know. I don't remember you getting uh, getting one of those, but you know, whatever. Every little bit helps, I guess, kind of. Thank heaven you're all safe, kindred hunter. You did it again. Many thanks. It shames, uh, it shames me we had to put you through this. Well, I'll be. Turns out your swift action saved them right in the nick of time. I'm not going to whistle because I, I feel like whistling into the mic would be kind of upsetting. Well, not really upsetting. I, I don't think. I just don't think I should do it. <laughs> okay. Uh, and that's a second miracle you've pulled off, too. You also survived the Gormagala while at sea. I figured any hunter that ran into the Gormagala once, or the front of the monster once, was a goner, let alone twice. <laughs> Golden Master, please honor this request. Give this hunter the mission we could not complete. Allow this brave soul to exterminate the Gormagala. No one is more capable, please. Hmm? This hunter? Ah, very well. Listen up, everyone. The Gormagala has been reassigned to this hunter here. All guild resources have been shifted accordingly, and make it snappy. <laughs> You will have our assistance as well. We shall return to the guild and learn what we can about the Gormagala. I give you my heartfelt oath that the four of us will determine uh will uh, four of us will determine what we what that man is called where that man is called off to. Ooh wee! How about that? That's the kind of hunt that makes the, uh, that makes or breaks careers. Go get him, kindred hunter. Show these folks what I already know. That you're the one to get it done. Let's stop by Caravan HQ first though. Them they must be tearing out their hair by now. Tearing tearing. Ugh. I'm really good at English, guys, I swear. Alright, um... I'm gonna go over here. Talk to you first. Wow, Hunter, thanks for knocking that uh, Gypsaurus for a loop. Oh, this is the one that gave us a gypsy, the dual, dual Gypsaurus quest? Okay. Uh, I better hide out while the going's good. Hang tight, little bro. Don't be dead. Little sis is, uh... I'm on my way. Okay. Oh, that was for her. See, I thought that was for the meat. Doodle, this is it. You knew this one would come, or I did at least. It's time to confront that mysterious Gormagala, the monster the guild was tracking. And the same son of a gunlance who knocked our beloved ship. For a loop. The Ace Hunters did everything in their power, but now, now, this vital mission has been placed squarely in your squarish hands. Behold my notebook. See how its pages twitch and its bindings burn for the scribblings of a high caliber? I chose to travel the world to know every last thing there is about monsters, and you know what? I picked a couple of winners when I set my sights on the boss and then you. Doodle. Doodle! I am complete! <sighs> or at least I will be once you nail that sucker and, and give me all the deets. Anyway, as the boss would say, you're the one to get it done. Alright, so now our urgent quest is to take on the Gormagala. But, that'll be all for this episode. This episode's about 30 minutes. I didn't think it'd end up being this long, but if I didn't fuck up so hard, it wouldn't have been. But, oh wait, hold on. I want to see what this is. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so, um, what I'm going to do is, uh, I'm going to end the episode. I'm going to do a little bit of uh, off-screen grinding, because uh, I want to upgrade this sword. What do I need? I think I need Sleepy Fish. I think that's what I need, just because I want to get the Gormagala and the monster after we have to fight done with, because they're annoying to fight. Actually, I could... No, 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 no. I'm probably going to end up cheese killing them, unfortunately. Um, I need... Three. Nope, I can't upgrade to this because I, I would need Gravio Scalp. So, can't upgrade to that. Um, I'll see if I can upgrade. Uh, no, this is 180. Alright, whatever. I'll stick with this for now then. I'll just worry about the sleepy fish later. Okay, so, if you did enjoy this episode, please be sure to uh, like, comment, subscribe for more content. And I'll see you guys next time on Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate. Later.